Good morning, everyone. So I will. I just want to show you how you're going to tackle this um, particular task, which is the um, the AMAC task. So um, this one, yeah, I might not be using time use for this. Um, I will just use the the sandbox straight away. But if you want to use the time use, uh, you're still cool and you're still okay by that. But uh, for me, I won't be using the time use. But I mean, you can either use whatever floats your boat. So uh, for this particular tax that I want to do here, the EMAC tax. So uh, let me just come here and and do this. So let me just open my web timing now. Uh, but before I open the web timing, at least you can see this is the answer to these right here and these is these and these these and these so that is it on your quiz um, meanwhile for this tag so let me just open my sandbox and let me use the sandbox so uh, in order to avoid different um, kind of um, having to use all your different sandbox and all those things so for me personally, I just use one simple, one single um, sandbox. If I open this one, I'm just going to use these all true um, for, for the old project. So it all depends. I mean, but I feel why should I be open to sandbox since all the sandbox are actually the same thing. So I can just do this. I can just do this. Um, uh, so let me go now. So the query, the said, um, the said, navigate to the root and create a directory named 0x02-mx. Yeah, so that's just the instruction. So I'm going into the root cd. Uh, let me just check where I am. PWD. Yeah. So uh, we're actually in the root. Yeah, you see. So. Um, we are now in the root now, and so inside the root, they said we should create a file called 0x02 underscore mx. So just do 0 uh, mk mk dir 0x02. Then you see underscore mx. So that is it and um, hit enter so make directory simply make you should make a directory make a folder and that is what they ask you to do and you've been able to achieve that so and now let us just check and see if our code actually works so uh, let me just do this and see okay you're telling me i'm in the root let me check what is inside the root yeah, so I'm having 0 x02 underscore mx. So that is it. So let me just check this code and see if it works. Okay, yeah, so that's passed. Uh, we've created this. So the next question is they say, okay, what is the command to open a file um, from within mx? So write the answer into this, and um, so we we need to inside this root we need to go into this guy and write the answer into this. So we cd into the file with the folder we created. That is cd um, into. So um, I think I'll just prefer to use my arrow up, and um, yeah. So this is the arrow up, arrow down key. So arrow up save all your um, saving memory all the command you've typed before so I'm using so I'm just using my arrow left and right to move left and right and arrow up and down so this the the terminal keep tracks of all your commands everything you've typed earlier on so if I so if I click enter now I'm in here so if I'm even scrolling up and down you see all the all my previous commands I could actually retrieve them like this so yeah, so I've seen the into this guy now, and we were told that oh, we should we should create a file. We should write into the file opening. I mean, 
you can validate if the format of your answer is correct by displaying the file information. So the next thing we need to, to do now is just touch opening. So just do, um, we create the file, touch opening and um, hit enter. And the next thing is you write into the file that command. So how do we write? Use your echo. So and small letter C dash X and C um small letter C dash F. So opening. Yeah, so that is done. LS. So now let us check if this is going to work. Oh, sorry, please. I made an error here. That's not what it's supposed to be. Uh, this is what it's supposed to be. Sorry. <laughs> Just, uh, yeah, cap C. So capital letter C, sorry, please, not the small letter C. Don't make, I don't know why I make that mistake. So let's hit the enter. And now let's check our code if this works. Uh, so um, naturally, uh, I think I'm not a fan of Emac, but I'm just doing this for this tutorial. So yeah, so we've been able to do these. Now let us create the file. So now they said, okay, what is the command to save the file? So we need to go into this guy again, create this file, then write the command inside. So, but don't forget, we are already in Emacs, so we don't need to be moving in and out, in and out. So let us just do um, search. Sorry about oh, that. So search, um, search saving. So we all know that search is actually the command used to to create a file. So we've created the touch, like if you do ls, you will see that file there. So the saving is inside there. So I want to write into the saving now. So I do echo, echo. Uh, so I won't make this mistake, mistake again. Uh, C, uh, cup C. Dash X, then uh, sorry, dash S. So we do this, and we type the save in there. So we are writing into this file that command. So if I hit enter, we've written it into the saving file. Like, okay, we've written that command in there. And um, if we check our code, let us just check the code and see if it works. Okay, yeah, so that works. So um, the third one that said, what is the command to cut an entire line of code? Uh, so as the normal procedure, we don't need to move an out. Let us just create this um, file. Let us create the file, search, cutting. Mm -hmm. So, Hit enter and ls to check if that's available. Yeah. So now let us write into into uh, into it. So to cut, you need to do echo ck. So um, echo so. Button. So here is the command. So that's the command. So we've done that. Um, hit enter. And then let us check this code again. If that passed the test. So I mean, you just need to get yourself, um, I mean, get to understand the Emax command line. Uh, so I think after doing this tax, I actually fall in love with Vi more than the Emacs because there is no lot of
complications or lots of commands to mix together. So now the next question is um, write the command to paste. Yeah, write the command to paste. So as usual, we'll create the file. So let the touch. We're pasting, yeah, this to paste. Oh, sorry for that type error. Pasting. So we hit enter. Then, um, so let us write into it now. Echo. Echo C. Dash Y. And just put your angle back here and do your pasting. Hit enter. So let us check this out again. If it's passed that test, hopefully it does. So the next thing is um, uh, we are looking at the command to search forward. The command to search forward. So that is searching. We need to write this inside the searching um, file. So let us create the file first. Um, search searching hit enter then we can now write into it we can echo into it so echo um capital C um yeah you want to be sure my eyes is yeah so I want to search right capital C then search S So and do your search searching. So key tensor, let us check again if this works. So now the next one uh Okay, the set to undo to undo a command. So uh, to undo a command, what do we use to undo a command? So we create the file first. Touch that's undoing. Okay, undoing. Touch undoing. Uh, touch undoing. Then. Yeah. His answer. So let us write into it the command we need to use to undo um, whatever we've written before. So we do echo echo c dash x and undo. Undoing, yeah. So, um, uh, okay. so let us check this out too and see if we got this right. Yeah, so yay. Now the next one is how to quit. So, um, so how to quit. <laughs> Let us just do that. As usual, sure. since the set, we should write it into the file. So please, you need to take note of um, when you're doing your your task, there are a lot of write into these. So you don't mix up a file with a folder. And when they say you write into, you need to understand that process and procedure. So, touch, what file, touch quitting, quitting, then eat enter. So let's write into that and we do echo, mm. echo here, capital C, quitting. And this and um, quitting. Yeah, then hit enter. Let's check our code. 
and see who will pass that. Yeah, so guys, um, this is the task for MX, and we've successfully run through these, and um, that is it for for you today. So, ah, uh, I promise I'll be dropping um other tasks like solving this problem for you, uh, at least. But please, before you opt into watching this video, please ensure you've tried on your own to solve the task. Then, if you're unable to do um, reach out to people that you can always watch video, but please for you to make this thing sticks and for you to stay You literally need to exercise that muscle and try to walk around and reach you So if you like this video, please do go well to share subscribe and uh, Like thank you and I promise I'll be dropping more on ALX for you guys. Thank you so much